everyone, and a super warm welcome back to another exciting video. Greetings, tech enthusiasts, cybersecurity aficionados, and everyone curious about the fascinating realm where networks meet security. Welcome, or welcome back, to the channel where we delve deep into the technologies that shape our digital world and explore the crucial practices that keep it safe. Today, we're embarking on an in-depth journey to unravel the intricacies of a powerful and widely discussed tool within the cybersecurity landscape, specifically within the context of the formidable Kali Linux distribution. I'm talking about the one and only Wi-Fi. Now, in an era where wireless connectivity has become as essential as the air we breathe, the security of these wireless networks is paramount. Think about it, from our homes and offices to public hotspots, we rely on Wi-Fi for almost everything. This ubiquity makes wireless networks a prime target for those with malicious intent and, consequently, a critical area of focus for security professionals and ethical hackers alike. Understanding the potential vulnerabilities and the tools used to identify them is a cornerstone of building a more secure digital ecosystem. Before the advent of highly automated tools like Wi-Fi, assessing the security of Wi-Fi networks often involved a more manual and intricate process. Security analysts would need to orchestrate a series of commands using different specialized tools, each with its own syntax and nuances. Wi-Fi emerged as a solution to streamline this complex process. Imagine having a conductor for an orchestra of wireless hacking tools. That's essentially what Wi-Fi orchestrates and automates a range of attacks against wireless networks, primarily targeting those secured with the now ubiquitous WPA and WPA2 protocols, as well as the often criticized WPS. At its heart, Wi-Fi harnesses the power of several foundational tools that are staples in the wireless security world. You'll find it leveraging the capabilities of the Aircrack NG Suite, renowned for its packet capturing and password cracking abilities. Utilizing WPS, Wi-Fi often employs tools like Reaver and Pixies, which are specifically designed to exploit vulnerabilities in the WPS handshake mechanism. By integrating these tools, Wi-Fi automates the often repetitive tasks involved in the initial stages of a Wi-Fi penetration test. Let's briefly touch upon some of the typical stages involved in a Wi-Fi security assessment that Wi-Fi helps automate. First, it typically begins with network discovery, passively listening for and identifying nearby wireless networks, along with crucial information like their SSIDIS network names and the security protocols they employ. Once potential targets are identified, Wi-Fi can then move on to attempting to capture the essential handshake, a crucial piece of data exchanged when a client device connects to a WPA, WPA2 protected network. This handshake is the key ingredient for attempting to crack the network's password. Furthermore, Wi-Fi pays special attention to the WPS protocol. WPS was intended to simplify the process of connecting devices to a Wi-Fi network, often using a simple PIN. However, vulnerabilities in the WPS implementation have been widely discovered and exploited. Wi-Fi incorporates techniques to attempt to retrieve the WPS PIN, which, if successful, effectively grants to the network, regardless of the complexity of the WPA, WPA to password. Now, it's absolutely imperative that we reiterate a point of paramount importance. The information and tools discussed in this video are strictly for educational purposes and for use in authorized security assessments where you have explicit permission to test a network. Engaging in any unauthorized attempts to access or compromise wireless networks is illegal and unethical, carrying serious consequences. Our aim is to empower you with knowledge so that you can better understand the security landscape and, if you're working in or aspiring to work in cybersecurity, utilize these skills responsibly and ethically within the bounds of the law. So, who will benefit most from watching this video? security student eager to grasp the practical aspects of wireless security. A network administrator looking for tools to test the resilience of your own infrastructure. An ethical hacking enthusiast wanting to expand your skill set within the Kali Linux environment. 
or simply someone with a keen interest in understanding how these powerful tools operate, then you've come to the right place. Throughout this video, we plan to not only explain the theoretical underpinnings of Wi-Fi, but also potentially delve into some of its more commonly used options and attack modes. We might even explore scenarios where Wi-Fi proves particularly effective and highlight some of its limitations. Our goal is to provide you with a well-rounded understanding of what Wi-Fi is, how it functions, and its role in the broader context of wireless security. Get ready to embark on an enlightening exploration of Wi-Fi on Kali Linux. We've got a wealth of information to share, and I'm confident that by the end of this video, you'll have a much clearer understanding of this powerful tool. Don't forget to show your support by hitting that like button if you find this introduction intriguing. And if you're new here, consider subscribing to stay updated on our latest deep dives into the world of cybersecurity and